Right, you guys, got another video here for you. Now, if you're having uh, mail issues, i.e. Windows 10 mail inside the Creators Update, after you've updated, maybe you're having sync issues or you can't add uh, a new mail account or it just won't open or you're having issues with it, then I'm going to show you some steps uh, to take to fix this. Now, we have got a post on the forums where someone's having trouble, so I thought I'd make a quick video to show you some steps that you can take to try and rectify uh, this issue. So the first thing you want to try is you want to go down to the uh, Windows flag icon here or the start button and then click settings. Inside here you want to go to apps. Once the apps is open uh, you want to come down to where it says mail. You can see mail and calendar here. Click on this one and then from here you want to go to where it says advanced options. Click on that. And the next thing you want to do is click on reset and this will uh, permanently delete the app data on this device including all your preferences and signing details this may be a corruption here and it's always best to try this first okay and that could rectify the problem now if that doesn't work then what we're going to do is uninstall it and reinstall it okay so first off what we're going to do here now what you want to do is restart your computer. So once you've restarted your computer, it will start doing the updates. So I've just uh, restarted there. So now we have our computer restarted. What we want to do is uh, remove the mail and calendar app, okay? And to do this, we're going to go onto the flag icon here, which is your start button. Right click here and go to Windows PowerShell Admin. This will open up the PowerShell and you should see Administrator Windows PowerShell. Then what we want to do is paste in our command. So we're just going to put this big command in here and you can see what it's going to do. It's just basically going to remove, remove the uh, Microsoft Windows Communications app, which is your uh, mail and uh, calendar. Okay, push enter, and this will then start to uh, remove that. You can see it's been removed down the bottom here. So what we want to do next, uh, you can uh, do this in command, but what we're going to do is I'll show you another way. You can go to the store here. And uh, all you need to do is uh, type in store and up will come the Microsoft Store. Open this up. And from here, what you want to do is put mail. And you can see here, since you put mail in, mail in calendar. Click on this one. And you want to push get. And this will start to install. So what we want to do now, it says this product has been installed. We want to close this off and we want to reboot our computer. So let's go ahead and reboot. And there we are back at the uh, desktop. And you, and you will have the uh, mail icon missing here, but don't worry, we can put that back. So all you're doing here now is going to go to your mail. So come down here. You can see mail. Right click on this, move, and you can pin this to your taskbar like so. Now if you're still having issues with syncing, uh, where it's not syncing properly, I'll show you a, a fix. Because after the update to the uh, creators update there was an issue with, uh, with syncing and adding new apps and I'll show you that right now so what we're going to do here is uh, try to reinstall the missing packages uh, in mail when you're having troubles with syncing so what we're going to do here is go down to the search and type CMD and we're going to run the command prompt here as administrator so right click run as administrator say yes to the user account control and this will open up our command prompt now you're going to need to paste in 
this command here. We'll leave this in the uh, video uh, description so you can just copy and paste it. Push enter and this will start to bring uh, that package down. Okay, you can see the operation has completed successfully. Now once that is done, this will uh, resolve the uh, resync issue. So what you need to do again is just quickly reboot the system. You can see it wants to update all the time and that's because we're fixing uh, issues. And uh, once we get back here, you should be able to open up your mail uh, client here and you should be able to add new accounts here like so. Okay, and that should resolve that issue. So if you are having those issues, then that's the way you can work around and try, hopefully try to fix your mail issue inside Windows 10. Anyway, if you have any more problems, then head over to the forums and I can try and help you out over there. Just a quick video. I hope this one helps you out. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Thanks again for watching, guys, and thanks for your continued support. Have a good day. Bye for now. Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.